when should the three of us meet again? Will it be in thunder, lightning, or rain? Oh, man, and when the noise of the battle is over, when one side is won and the other side is lost. That will happen before sunset. Where should we meet? Let's do it in the open field. We'll meet Macbeth there. I'm coming, Grey Malkin. My toad paddy calls me. I'll be right there. Fair is foul and foul is fair. Let's fly away through the fog and filthy air. I have never seen a day that was so good and bad at the same time. Neither have I. What are these creatures? They look like aliens. They are women, yet they have beards. Speak if you can. What kind of creatures are you? All hail Macbeth, Thane of Glamis, Cawdor, and the future king. Are you real or imaginary? If you are truly supernatural, tell me my future. You are lesser than Macbeth, but also greater. You are not as happy as Macbeth, yet much happier. Your children will be kings, but you will not. Wait, you only told me part of what I want to know. Stay and tell me more. Tell me where you learn these strange things, and why you stop us at this desolate place with this prophetic greeting. Speak, I command you. Whoa, are we high? Your children will be kings. You will be king. And Thane of Cawdor too? Isn't that what they said? That's exactly what they said. Has the former Thane of Cawdor been executed? My king! They haven't come back yet, but I spoke with someone who saw Cawdor die. He died like someone who had practiced how to toss away his most cherished possession as it were a worthless piece of garbage. My worthiest kinsman, all I can say is that I owe you more than I can ever repay. The opportunity to serve you is its own reward. Now let's go to your castle at Inverness, where I will become even more obliged to you. The witches met me on the day of my victory in battle, and I have since learned that they have supernatural knowledge. When I tried desperately to question them further, they vanished into thin air. While I stood spellbound, Messengers from the king arrived and greeted me as the Thane of Caldor, which was precisely how the weird sister had saluted me before calling me the future king. I thought I should tell you this news, my dearest partner in greatness, so that you could rejoice along with me about my greatness that has promised to us. Keep it secret and farewell. You are the Thane of Caldor and Glamis, but I worry about whether or not you'll have the guts to take the crown from Duncan. My dearest love, Duncan is coming here tonight. And when is he leaving? He plans to leave tomorrow. That day will never come. We will speak about this further. Try not to arouse suspicion. Hey, Dad. Uh, nice hat. Why, thank you, son. I just bought it. So, uh, you think I can uh, get that? Not yet. Maybe when you are older. Or when I die. Whichever happens first. Alright. Is this a dagger I see in front of me? With its handle pointing toward my hand? Come, let me hold you. I don't have you, but I could still see you. Fateful apparition. Isn't it possible to touch you as well as see you? Or are you nothing more than a dagger created by the mind? A hallucination from my fevered brain. I could still see you, and you look as real as this other dagger I'm pulling out now. You both know Banquo was your enemy. It's true, my lord. He's my enemy too, and I hate him so much that every minute he's alive, it eats away at my heart. Though our law- I can see the determination in your eyes. It must be done tonight, away from the palace. You must kill both Banco and his son, Fleance. We'll do what you want, my lord.
from the highest to the lowest of you, I bid you a hearty welcome. Please excuse me, I will go and get the turkey now. Whoa! The table's full. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. Just look over there. Look, see? See? I think it's time to leave. I insist that you answer my questions. I command you. Beware, Macduff. Nobody born a woman shall harm you. You will never be defeated until Burnham Wood marches to Dunsinane Hill. You're not fit to be king. You're not even fit to live. Now, we will fight Macbeth together. When was the last time you saw her sleepwalking? Every night since Macbeth went to war. Have you heard her say anything? Yes, but I can't repeat it. You could tell me. You really should. I'm a doctor. Look. Here she comes. This woman needs a priest more than a doctor. Good night, good doctor.